back. This is the ducks, you know. Just let's keep going. Welcome back to Sunday Ducks. I'm Bermuda and she's Phil. And <laughs> today we're playing Asa. <laughs> yeah, I meant to have a word with you, Phil, about this. Because, like, before, whenever we would, like, cut the video up, the second, like, part two or part three would begin and we wouldn't, like, introduce yeah. ourselves. So we don't have to in introduce ourselves at, at every, you know, just at, yeah. at the first one, I think. This is, I agree. this is how I feel. I, just, I was doing it anyway. Yeah, you were. I'm so near. You're such a rebel. I know, right? I'm a rubble. That, that you a Barney rubble. <laughs> uh, there's a book on this island somewhere. <laughs> I sense a book on this island somewhere. Here it is. It's a special kind of book. There's a book in my house somewhere. Is it a law book? You know it, girl! Oh no, this is a lore book. Phil. Are you, are you dissing me for the fact that I say law instead of law? They both sounded the same just now. Exactly. <laughs> Butter. I say lao when I mean to say the word lao. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I worked with a French guy who uh, would, would pronounce the word law like that. that you'd be like a lao... It's against the Lao, and I was like, the what? Oh, I see what you're saying. Oh, I see your hideous accent has destroyed the word law. No, it wasn't accent as much as, like, he kind of thought that's how the word is spelled, so that's how it should be pronounced, and, like... Yeah, I'm sure that's what true, it is. True, you should pronounce words the way they're spelled, but, like, English is so screwed up that, you know, things are spelled all kinds of ways. Like, okay, I'll use this as, a, as an example. The number... One. It's spelled like own, you know, like like bone or phone or alone. <laughs> but like it, you you say one. What that doesn't make sense, does it? One. Also, if you <coughs> won a game, like that's spelled differently but pronounced the same, and it's fucking confusing. English, sort your shit out. <laughs> Well, it's because we've stolen different words from all many other languages, right? Yeah, it is. It is because of that. English is comprised of... It's a Frankenstein, really. It's a Frankenstein's monster of languages, which is its greatest strength and its greatest weakness. Hmm. Because, like, you know, if you speak English, you can kind of understand bits of, like, several other different languages. But it also leads to these kinds of inconsistencies, which just make it really confusing yeah. for everybody. Nobody wants that. No. Ain't nobody got time for that, Bermuda? Hail. 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 Yeah. You know what else that SWOTOR spoiled me for was being able to play the game with one hand, like drive my character with my mouse so I could like take my hand off the keyboard. Yeah, it's irritating. I but... just had to itch my temple just now, but that means I had to stop my horse. Yeah. But I mean like you can if you were to just so happen to like map your uh like stuff just all on one hand like I'm doing I can jealous I'm jealous I mean you must know your secret it's cuz you you've got your push talk on your on your mouse yeah I don't so that means I can push talk and talk by having used my left hand and still ride my horse I think it has nothing to do with the push to talk button well, why, what do you use for riding your horse? I use my mouse to like look around to aim the direction of where my horse is oh, going. Oh, right. You don't press A and D. Well, I can press A and D to like go that way or whatever, but like my camera still stays pointed wherever my mouse is pointed. I'm taking this, by the way. Okay. This rune, blue rune. Blue rune. Well, I mean, uh, 
generally you know the direction you're going, right? Because you know where the quest marker is. If you just pretty much put it in that general direction, then like you'll pretty much be always pointing forwards. So what do you mean? Kind of generally point towards the quest marker and then take your hand off the mouse and just drive with like WASD yeah. to avoid obstacles and whatnot. Yeah. But then you have to use your mouse again eventually. Yeah, yeah occasionally, but not like 100% of mm. the time. Okay. And look what we got here. Oh, right. Ah. Make sure you get a hit on this guy. Did you get the complete feet chieftain uh -huh, room stealth? Oh, good. Oh, thank God. Yeah. I would have flipped out if this was like, nope, you didn't even touch your wands, kind of thing. Mm. Well, I made sure to use a spell on him, so... Because I think probably if you just auto-attack, it doesn't count or something. Deathus. Uh, Something hasn't quite worked for me. I need to collect his head, yet it didn't allow me to. Mm. We have to collect Gurlisk's head, yeah? Yeah. Well, that wasn't Gurlisk, that was Diffus. Oh. So, you know, that might be why. I've untied this dude, and now what's going to happen? Free Diffus, and now follow him. Ah. Uh, what quest is this? Savages of Stone Falls. Oh, maybe it wasn't. No, it totally wasn't. Okay, the one called A Goblin's Affection. We should be doing that one. Okay. I have to talk to Valdem and Dorin? Yes, that's the next area. I accidentally led us here okay. thinking this was the quest that we were doing, but it wasn't. But at least it's a green one that we're getting out of the way, eh, Bermuda? Yeah, we need to do that. Filthy goblins! It stole my wife! Why is it... Okay, what, this was a different guy? We've just picked up a new quest, is what oh, just I happened now. Was quest. No, he had okay, the well... new quest marker above his head. I'm sorry. Phil, I'm a little worried about you. Are you feeling okay? <laughs> I've forgotten what new quest and hand-in quest looks like. Here's the hand-in quest one, though. I hope these two spider are... Wrangler gloves, and they're level 10. Oh, wrangle uh. me some spiders. They're level 10? Oh, wonderful. Yeah. Bacon. <laughs> Well, let's go back into this little area and collect some Balmora Blue Waffle wine. Mmm. Squeezed fresh from Blue Waffle. <laughs> Disgusting. Someone Do you have one of ten? Or? Nope. Doesn't count for some reason. Are you able to pick up the ones I pick up, or is it literally going to no. make us double the time? Yeah, it's going to double the time because I tried Ugh. to pick up the same one you were po picking up, and it said someone else is using that. Ah, uh, this game... Well, it's because these are items that have to go in your quest inventory instead of, like, just things that just happen when you click them. Yeah, Swartor but it's, had it's, the same problem. Bullshit. Yeah, but it's the same problem Swartor had. So it's it's a problem that they don't care about fixing, despite the fact it really irritates the shit out of everyone. Yeah, I mean, like, and there's a pretty simple fix for this. Just, just do away with quest items that have to go in your inventory. You can take that other one. There were two here and I took one and no, it was for you. Fine. Okay. Okay. But yeah, I mean, like, just do away with physical quest items that you have to pick up. Just, or just like, make it so click it, it and be done. It, dis it disappears from my screen but stays on your screen and you can yeah. click it as well. Well, that might be a little difficult. I don't know. I don't know how games are built. Well, this game, with its massively making utterly, utterly everything become instanced. Like, that's all ten for me. Mm -hmm. I need one more. There's lots up there. I want to go where there aren't goblins. Oh, deer skin. Mm. It still has spots, so it was a baby deer skin. Yay. The most delicious kind. Doe, mm. a deer, a female deer. Oh no, it's caught inside my teeth. 
Yeah, it'll do that. It's delicious. Right, so we've got a place down to the south where we can get a sky shard, which we are zero of three, so we're not going to shard this time, sadly. No. Working on it. I know. Building up some Blue. juices. <laughs> fart juices. Yeah, fart juice. Don't drink the fart juice. <laughs> hey, there's like a crafting place to unlock. Yeah. That. We go get, yeah. get in there. Go Back like, hey, floor. girl. Woo. Yeah. I see you, baby. Shaking that ass. Shaking that lava. Magma flow overload. Discovered. Oh, don't follow me. Oh, God. Oh, Lock God. Ah, oh, totally. Let me get the stuff in this wagon. What, Aslan's grip? What did that say? He's an ass man. Ashen grip. Ah! Ah! Phil. Wow, you really shouldn't follow me. Don't worry, I'm not. Good. My silly wife. <laughs> Happy life, if you have a happy wife. Right, so. Hmm. I bought a KitchenAid standing mixer and, you know, it came with some documentation and manual and stuff. And there was a, a photo of like old timey black and white photo from when the company was like kind of new or whatever and they had like a company truck with the KitchenAid logo on it mm -hmm. and surrounding the logo was like I guess their motto or something and it said mm -hmm. keep your wife looking younger with KitchenAid <laughs> so she doesn't have to work so hard and get looking all haggard and old and worn <laughs> buy our products for a younger looking wife <laughs> Jump through that lava and come out here. You know you want to. Come out here. That yeah, by here. Like, like where you are? Here, here. Alright, chickweed, here we go. No. Nah. Nah. Oh, I stayed on my horse. Good chickweed. I know. It's those fireproof horseshoes. She loves horseshoes. fire. I put some fireproof horseshoes on there. <laughs> They're diamond horseshoes. Diamond. I ride a pony with diamond horseshoes. Should be pony shoes. They're very slightly smaller and more expensive. My little pony. Crazy tech pony. Oh yeah, my my Decker in Shadowrun is a centaur. My little pony. Yeah. <laughs> she paint. Name is. Is, I want to say like gri grizzle kicks. I was like, <laughs> no, no, <laughs> glitter kicks. <laughs> grizzle kicks. Oh, look what it is. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Hey, why didn't my crystals work? Get crystal. Son of a bitch. I'm like pointing the wrong way. What? Ooh, lore book. <gasps> Bwah. Are you healing him? Are there we go. Me? Now my crystals worked. Boom. Yeah, girl. Woo. Satisfied? Yes. We collected his head. Now you've collected his head. Mm -hmm. And the lore book. Yeah, girl. So. Wish. Quest called Simply Misplaced, which is to the south. Mm -hmm. Let's go that away. Oh, yeah, that's the Mage's Guild quest. 
quiet, which will probably end end up in us uh, doing another solo mission. What? Hang on a sec. What is this quest? We have a green quest. Right at the north of the map. Why is it way over there? Exactly, it's crazy, isn't it? Someone tells me it's gonna... like a thing that when we get there, they're going to be all like, now go back down the map and do these things for me. Yeah, or it'll just be grey by the time we get there, so we just yeah. can abandon it. We'll see. Let's see how far we get. So, mm -hmm. should we go Some to this quest down this yeah, way? I'm waiting to follow you. Uh, why why you take such dangerous route? <laughs> Diamond horseshoes. Oh yeah, girl. Didn't take any damage from that fall. It's because you're a special kind of person. A Bosmer. We're called Bosmer. Uh and you're a skilled horse. Look what it is. Oh yeah. Oh, so much So much lore. lore. Very book. Mm. And apparently another quest to pick up now. Yeah. Every lore book makes me stronger. <laughs> A letter from Deshaun. Deshaun. <laughs> Find Dandruff Dan. <laughs> Walk off the edge. No! I'm on fire. No! I need help. I'm dead in the lava. Wait, 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 wait. Don't resurrect me. Oh. Thank you, my dear wife. Get moving. Nah. nah. There we go. Oh, it's, it was just too steep for my little horse. <laughs> Is this telling us to go into a different zone? Uh, probably, because do you remember she was just in the building we came out of? And then they were like, speak to Velast, but not in that building, so it's in like the next zone? Uh, uh, uh. Right, well, then the next quest isn't here. Dandruff Dan. I don't know. Destroy the crystal. Yeah, North. destroy the crystal. Yeah, stem the tide. Stem cells. Is there anything stem cells can't do? Tap dance. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's horrendous. I got the blues, craft macaroni and cheese. The blue box blues. Why are you standing there? What are you doing? <laughs> it's like map issues. Oh, sorry. Maps in my shoes. Mm, I need a map to your shoes, cause I wanna know where you got those shoes. Got them from Clark's, a, a shoe shop in the UK. Oh, not kinky boots? No, I do not have woman shoes for men, no. <laughs> Size 46 uh, lady shoes. <laughs> uh, sorry, European 46, what was <laughs> UK 11 or something. So, Random. wait. What? Nothing. Continue. In the UK, like in UK shoe sizes, do you have like different, like, like if you have like a size seven women's and a size seven men's, they're not actually the same no. actual size, right? No. They're different. Yes. That's silly. The face is silly. <laughs> I mean, it's like a woman can be a size ten and a man can be a size ten in like trousers. But, like, it's different things. 
silly to just use like whatever centimeters it is and stuff. Cause like you know. I mean Americans have clothes that they call size zero. What the hell? You're not invisible. <laughs> I know, that is pretty stupid. I remember like seeing size zero trousers for the first time once and I was just like what? what? What does this mean? And I think there's like size double zero as well, which is like repeatedly stupid. Yeah, or maybe they even go into the negative numbers? I don't know. I don't know. Soft loam cavern. Hmm, nice. What's a loam? No, but this one's very soft. Who is a loam? I've got like, a raging a loam, loam on soft? right now. <laughs> raging softy. Raging low mod. <laughs> or raging alone. lard on. <laughs> where oh. I just cover myself in, in lard. Oh, which if you don't yeah. know is like a fat, like fat, basically. Are you explaining that to me or to the audience? Anyone. Okay. My little pony. So it's, we probably can't go down this way. It pretty much every time makes it go a long way. So, so like it's this way. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's long way in, short way out, every single time. We picked up a friend. A human friend, or looks like a human friend. Or I mean, you know, elf or whatever, Khajiit and Dargunian. player As friend. As in a yeah, a PC instead of an NPC. Oh yeah, aww. I like your outfit, what? little lizard lady. Our lizard Hey there, little lady. Yeah, she has a cool outfit. Look, it's nice looking. It's pretty. I'm gonna loot her corpse when she dies. She's got little, like, jingle bells. Jingle bells, Argonian smells. Oh my god, I can loot a corpse? Been so long. One of these things are not like the other. Where's Toby? Toby, get out here! Oh, maybe because I died in lava. Maybe. Yeah, get a girl. Yeah. Woohoo. <laughs> Shock. Shock. Blah. Woof. I loot the body. Loot the body. No. It's all just beverage stuff, beverage stuff, beverage stuff. Oh, assassination increased to 16. Ooh! Well One of these done. days I'm going to be able to actually kill a president. Mm. That spell takes forever to cast. I should just take that off my bar. <laughs> no, just keep it on there, it's fine. It does a lot of damage, but... Yeah, I mean it's better to just do damage, right? Mm-hmm. Bob's Morph, can I lick your ass? No, I just did a poop and uh, it's kind of stinky. But, but that's <laughs> when it's the best. It's like, some people like cheese when it's stinky and disgusting. Oh god. Ugh. Okay, I, I do eat cheese in some circumstances, but when you really think about what cheese is, it kind of just makes me want to stop eating cheese because it's it's a it's like a it's a bodily secretion that is infected with bacteria it, and and it's like oh you just ran past a mob that came out and burned me 
He's a gonna burn me. Cause it's like if if you if any part of your body smells like cheese, it usually means you have like some kind of infection. Wrong with you? Yeah, like there's a fungal infection or something. And yeah, it's like it's unclean, it's it's unsanitary. But it's okay for cheese to smell that way, and it's okay for us to eat <laughs> cheese that smells like a rotten body part. Like like what? I remember in in like school sex education and like you're learning about different like sexually transmitted diseases and stuff and like they were describing symptoms of like some disease or something and they were like like cheese like discharge and i was like you know what if nasty disease thingies can be described as being cheese like <laughs> why are we still eating cheese well alcohol's a poison so i mean like yeah we we put a lot of bad things in us. <laughs> we do. Maybe sometimes bad things can be good. Also, like if you have one of those cheeses that's full of blue or green mold or something, how do you know when it's gone off? <laughs> oh well, I mean, like those have blue. those have like blue lines that are like nicely through it and stuff and like the outside rotting is like the when it's going off kind of thing yeah but I mean like it's the principle of the thing it's like oh no my cheese is moldy no 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 it's okay oh no my cheese is moldy oh throw it out <laughs> you know it's like what <laughs> yeah it makes sense <laughs> right so this is that cave we went into before and uh, like last session and we were like, mm -hmm. wait a sec, I'm sure we need to do something with these little portly things. This time we've come back here and now we finally get to do it. Oh. The gruel. Oh, hey, Hario. Hey, welcome to our Saturday stream. Of Until we stop playing Skylights, uh, Sky Cities later. Skitties. Skitties Skylines. Kitty Skylines. Meow. Saturday is a good day for streaming, so, you know. Making the most of it. Dafflin. Talk to Dafflin. Are we literally done here? Yeah, I just picked up a shield, yo. Search that <sighs> shack. Oh, weird. yeah. Ooh, mint. That sounds very pleasant. Oh, yeah, mate infusion recipe. I, n I know I'm not <laughs> learning beverages, but I'm going to read it. Anyway. Uh, the mate? Yeah. Yeah, I just marked the health potion as junk. That's right. What are you gonna do? <laughs> Take it, baby. All right. Take a baby. <laughs> just steal I it. I picked these babies up on Old Mantel. You like? <laughs> no, I don't really like babies. Especially not Old Mantelian babies. <laughs> You're there. currently GMing Shadowrun. What? Get out of town. While watching this? You can multitask Very like an excellent GM. person. Tell all the people that you're GMing to, to watch the stream as well. <laughs> <laughs> Send them a link. Da -da -da -da. Loading screen. Phil, do you want to do the four fingered fortune teller? No. Okay. It's not long enough. Say yes, he is multi talented. Or yes, I'll send them a link. <laughs> People like, don't bother listening to me. Uh, I, I'm going to listen to other people talk anyway, so here we go. <laughs> Have this link. <laughs> Okay, can Loading screen. <laughs> uh, this place is pretty close, so let's go over here. Moo. Bermuda. Oh, here he is. Yeah. Where'd Toby go? Dafflin. He's gone. Uh. 
There's a the lover mm -hmm. stone over here. This... You're a horse lover. Yeah, much better. Yeah. That's so epic climbing. Horse climbing for the win. So oh, I've forgotten what my uh, stone is right now. I think it's the lady which gives us extra armor. Eh. Let's find out what the lover is. Increased, Increased spell, spell resistance. resistance. Yeah, I love that. I'll oh. pass. I'm a lady, not a lover. I'm a lover, not a beta. Mmm, baiting. <laughs> There's a like a open dungeon place over here with a sky shard in, so we may as well do that. Mm hmm Wait, unless it's Fungal Grotto. Is it? No. Uh, no, it's not. No, it's sure! It's not good. Slab on. Can't horse. I can't horse. I'm gonna die. Can't horse on a node even. Nope, I'm down at the bottom of the hill now, so... <laughs> eh. Hey, what are you trying to pick up? Hey, a big tentacle! Hey! Right, I'm going in this building now. Yeah, I'm gonna go tag that way shrine and come back. Okay, I see your tag point. Your There's also a quest giver outside the way shrine. No! I'm gonna pick up the quest. No, too many quests. Pick up the quest. Uh, I'll totally make us go in this place that we were gonna go into before we go into it, and then we'll have to go in there twice instead. You'll have to, and not me. Don't worry about me. I'll be waiting. The city of Kragenmoor. Okay. Yeah, it's totally in the place that we were about to go into. So it's a good thing we didn't. You were right to speak to that man first. I just got lucky. You got lucky with that man. Uh huh. I was up all night. You up all night to it. get lucky. Up all night to find quest givers. We having trouble getting up the. Uh... I'm a fat little Bosmer. Yeah, I killed that bull match. Hmm. Why, do, why are there always these, like, Wilson-esque statues uh, the second we enter this place? Wilson-esque? Oh, oh, yeah. Because it's Argonian Wilson! art. <laughs> it's Argonian art. Artgonian. Artgonian. Beautiful. All night to get Wilson. Yeah. Oh, my go. bag space is two slots left. Oh, I'm 39 out of 100. You've been picking up a lot of things, haven't you? Well, I started the game at like half capacity already, so that wasn't good. Uh, not great. Mm -mm. I have like 80 max capacity. Toby, get out of here. <laughs> I see you you started you're near the end of the session so not much focus is needed, okay? Good enough excuse. You get to have a break, uh Harry L cuz we're going to be finishing like in half an hour. In well, yeah, relatively soonish. And uh, we'll we'll be going for an hour's break and then be starting cities. Mm -hmm. We're gonna we're gonna start a brand. <laughs> Gotta start thinking of I names. I oh, hope the all the best... people that have been watching uh, aren't going to be sad that we're starting a new city. Lots well, of people like to watch uh, cities continue growing in size, but I don't know. We played Cronin's for a week. I think that you know. 
It lived its life, and we killed it. Hello? Sorry, just reading some books. This man, he need to die. Oh, he gonna die. Toby gonna claw him. Right, so we need whatever this thing was. This guy's potion somethings. Mm -hmm. Stolen potion. Oh, I like the way I tunnel through it to look at these stolen items. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> rub, 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 rub. Wait, is there a guy in here that has, like, a name? Because um, no. normally there should oh. be a named man. I haven't seen one yet. It's up all night to kill Toby. No, Toby. I'm so jealous of Harry that he gets to play an RPG uh, I know. this week. <gasps> well, he gets to play one. Yeah. I I'm 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 not entertaining enough. Yeah, that's right. You're boring. We're one boring motherfucker. Exactly. I mean, like I I don't know how to things entertaining for people out of like a story that isn't me randomly speaking utter rubbish. <laughs> well, maybe you should make a story that is utter rubbish. Yeah. Random. Yeah. Assassin Beetle examine. Nothing happens. Next assassin. Mmm. Don't remember what he sounded Scuttling like. on. <laughs> no, no, that, that's uh, Weaver. Weaver, yeah. Nix, he's like uh something. He he always went on about using the Dagon, right? Because like as one of mm. his things, like you know, uh, someone made a community item for him that turned like his tail into a tail that hold that held a dagon. Mm. So many people just like did the like thing that does that short couple of seconds stun, you know, the like thing where it's like the oh, spikes yeah. come out of the ground mm -hmm. and then like dagon you in the face. From the sides. Oh, you're back here. Hello. Oh, we've got like Ooh, quite a few. I need more like AOE stuff. I'm supposed to be a wizard. Where's my AOE? You're a wizard, Harry. I'm a Harry wizard. We get more later. Don't Call of nature. Wait, this is the boss. Hmm. Wow. A level up. Got a new weapon. It's a healing staff, and it's mm. level thirteen. So it's better than the one I have. But I mean, the damage is actually exactly the same. But it's slightly faster attack speed, weapon. apparently. So I now have this one. Yeah. Bitch. What are we doing now? Oh, we just leave. There's a recipe in here, and I'm gonna read it. Mmm, fried green tomatoes recipe. Tomatoes. Sorry, tomatoes. Tomato, tomato. Banana. Tomato, banana, tomato. Taco. A tomato. A t the, ta the pasta taco mafia. A, bun a banana taco. taco mafia. See, I would say banana taco, but you'd say banana <laughs> taco. What's banana taco. Oh my god. No, banana taco. Not yeah, banana yeah. taco. <laughs> Pasta taco mafia. <laughs> Jump around and <laughs> <I'm> dog lassie. <laughs> yeah. Banana taco. <sighs> banana taco mafia. Pasta taco mafia is even better though. They have much better focus on what they need. Which is more tacos. Covered in pasta. In their mafia. Uh. 
Wow. <lacht> Have you ever even looked more like Bermuda? <laughs> <laughs> Not on a note, even. <laughs> yeah. Just being confusing. <laughs> <laughs> that was Yeast. Like found up with, found where someone else is because I had to get out of here. Yeah, girl. We It was a fine dungeon. I will Time remember glad. it on a summer's day. <laughs> While jacking it. Eating a nice lolly. An ice lolly. A nice lolly. A nice ice lolly. Ooh. A nice lolly. An Icelandic lolly? Uh. No. Don't eat those. It's probably it's a poopsicle. Gross. Probably made out of like... Whale fat and really bland stuff because they love the yeah. bland out there in Iceland. Yeah, ice bland. Oh shit, he's wrecking it. Plock fisker. Uh, I know something about fisk is fish. I remember watching a program where there's like l luda fisk or something. I know that's a mm. completely different language. We're like, well, it's fine. Fish, which is like rotten, rotten fish foods. Mm-hmm. Deliciously vile. Makes you want to vomit. Yep. I've never had it. Oh, but I know I. what it is. It's Norwegian. It's Norwegian. Oh, tomorrow is Norway's national day. Hooray! The day they hungry. celebrate being different from everyone else. Well, you get to eat soon. Yeah. But I mean, like, speaking about the rotten fish, why am I hungry? And, like, cheese being, like, infected bodily secretions, so why am I hungry? Mm -mm. Oops, I'm getting on way. Were we, like, 10 past when we started, or, what, or like, 15 past or something? And I didn't look at the starting time, I just look at OBS tells me how long I've, I how see. Long I've been going, yeah. So we've got about 15 minutes left of the Yeah, I thought it was about show. 15 minutes. Because my hunger is growing. Mm. You've got a raging hunger on. <laughs> hey baby, you want to see my raging hung on? I'm hung on. I could eat a whole horse. Or centaur. Oh, I just really want to play my... my Rigger again. He's, mm -hmm. it, it just makes me so happy when I get to rig and go inside the robot's brain and, and shoot people. But you like, missed... we're gonna need to gonna need to buy some like non-killing non bullets. Bullets. You missed the chance to name him Mortis. Rigger Mortis. Oh god, I totally missed out. <laughs> Apparently, there's a book up here somewhere. I think it's above us. Ariel, do you know any people that have played a rigger that's called themselves Mortis? Because Rigger Mortis is such a good name. Don't steal it for your next character. <laughs> oh, or you could actually make it into an NPC and then, like, make it someone evil and call him Rigger Mortis. Kill the soldiers double. I don't remember this quest. Neither do I. Melling. Tor something tore its way out from the inside, Bermuda. What? She looks like Lyra's Titanborn. No! Yeah, girl. We chase the creature. Where you going? Watch Where you the going? tail. Talk to Ravioli. Have you seen my husband? Why 
Why is this room so squeaky? Why are these rooms so squeaky? Yeah, this room is just like... Maybe, maybe because there are horses here? I don't know. Horses? Hump, like humping squeak horses? <laughs> yeah, they're like wearing all their leather and leather stuff and it's just like... <laughs> hot. That's about what I figured. Yeah, hot leather horse bondage action. <laughs> Horse bondage. You heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. It's what we're doing horse to bondage. It's what we do to them when we ride them. We're just, we're... We do have to break them first. Break the spirit mm -hmm. of the horse. Yep. Ah, uh, there's another questy dude had to pick up over here. And when He's you talking break... to this dead body. When you break the spirit of the horse, you absorb the horse spirit. <laughs> you do that via the medium of eating its horse dick later. Yep, that's where you keep your spirit. Yeah? Yeah, it's in your That's dick. why women are hot and like soulless. Mm-hmm. So, uh, th you learn this if you ever join the Pasta Taco Mafia. <laughs> what are we doing here? We're going in here to collect an a heirloom in this person's bedroom. Which is upstairs, but I'm just checking around here for bookcases and things to get extra skills. Ah, did you get any yet? No. It's pretty sure we've been here before. Probably. Probably read all the books. Yes. Here we go, because you title. Oh, it's not disturbing at all. No, oh, it's pretty nice. Oh, um, yes, please. recipe. And a lock pick. Oh, yeah, I'll take that. That's all. That's all, folks. That's the end of my show. It's not the end of my show. Ooh. Oh, here we go. Ravioli wants another chat. I'll prove it to you of this idol. Oh mm -hmm. no, using the idol under its double. Okay, let's use the... Oh, he's flipping out! Oh, oh. I can't do both things at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> welcome to the show, Tamriel Drifter. <gasps> yeah, welcome to the show. <laughs> I hope you enjoy horse bondage. Uh, horse bondage gets better after you've trained your trained your horse in sprinting uh, for a while, doesn't it? Because you get like extra horse bondage. Yeah, the, you 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 give your horse more stamina. Keep going longer. Yeah. It's important. Uh, have I gone to the wrong place? Oh, it's downstairs, I see. Have you entered? Oh, have you already gone downstairs? No, I didn't know what I was supposed to do outside, so... Oh, I did you use... Did you... Oh, you used it? Wicked. Yeah, now I have to follow him. You've been saying wicked a lot today. Not necessarily well, it's wicked. All, not necessarily all on stream. It was like a lot of it was before we started streaming. Maybe I'm pleased with the way that things have been going. <laughs> I, you, I hope so. Have you so. considered that? Oh god, there's someone firing at me. This is painful. Some healing. Your face is painful. Ooh. Oh god, she totally owned me. Owned you like a horse and I'm gonna strap some leather on you and ride you. What? Oh, not again. <laughs> well, it is Saturday, you know what that <laughs> means. Saturday's horse bondage day. Mm-hmm. Oh come on! Who loves Stormwall? What do you what do you say about this? Nay means no. <laughs> oh my God! So does that mean horses continuously don't want us doing what we're doing to them? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. All Brings a whole like a whole new bit of information to all the th horrific things I've done to horses in my past. Mm-hmm. I'm a farmer, Daddy. I'm a farmer. <laughs> Uh, why do we apparently... It says that you're still down here, by the way. No, I'm not. <laughs> I know you know that, because <laughs> you can see me. Right. You can see me, can't you? Yeah, you're jumping up and down next to me. Yeah, okay. Let me just see what happens if we go back down here. Talk to Ruvali. Ballin. Yeah, no, it says go through this door, Ruvali's home. This is weird. Okay, okay, let's just go upstairs, see what happens. Hopefully it'll fix itself. We have to go up upstairs. All the way upstairs, yeah. 
Ruvali, Ruvali. We were going to expand. Do you want this idol? For ourselves. We wanted to trade. They were going to expand the plantation. Hooray! The cat man's inside the barn in the center of the plantation. Mm. I'll we'll find to us you. some moon sugar. Moon sugar. And this one poops in a box and cover its poops with sand, so its predators do not know it is around. Cause you eat litter box. I mean, how else? No, yeah, do? yeah. I just like I'm just trying to imagine it now, like a public restroom or something, and it's just like yeah, you just go in, you open the door, and it's just like it's a box of sand on the ground. Yeah. Rashada. Oh. oh God. I wonder if Khajiit penises uh, are barbed like normal cat penises. Probably. I mean, everything else about them is cat-like, except for you know they. Bipedal. Yeah. Bipedal. How to hey, buy exactly a two pedals. shard up there. Oh, we'll get it in a minute. We'll just click. Let's use this idol on. on the uh, how do I click it? Oh, Whoops. here we go. Oh, you killed him. Oh, no, yeah, no, never mind. I... We got it. Mwah. Somehow managed to get two of them, in fact. Ooh, we're that good. I used. I read the note. Hmm. Follow the rioters' plan. What does that mean? What does that mean? Mm. We'll do it live. We'll do it live! Uh, is this... Oh, there we go. Fourth. Hey! Nice. Sounds like toilets in France, allegedly. What? Toilets in France? <laughs> They're pretty normal, right? Or... I don't know. I've never been to France. Uh, I technically... I've been to the Paris airport. The Paris airport. Like, The Paris one. airport. The, the one... I don't know. The big one. Like, I've been to Paris, like normal Paris, and the toilets were pretty normal, I'd say. I might I might be wrong, though. I might just have completely not noticed that I was pooping in a box. But, I mean, you never know. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe in your home you have a sandbox on the floor. So yeah, maybe. When you went to France, you were like, yeah, it's a normal toilet. It's totally normal. It's like yeah, if you've grown up with something, if you've grown up with something and no one ever says anything different to you, like, let's imagine your parents told you that, like, never, never poop outside the house. Because, like, like oh, right, these were for tourists. So they, they've got secret, really rubbish sandbox toilets in France that are only for the uh, French people. I can imagine this. <laughs> Yeah, like imagine your parents were like, "Yeah, you must never poop outside the house. People will be able to follow you home." They're like, their parents are like, I know they've got some form of mental disorder, and think that people are chasing them all the time. And yeah, like they try and teach you never to go outside, and yeah, you do, and then like you never poop, and then it goes horribly wrong. He did say allegedly. Now I'm I'm not I'm, And then I'm you never saying, poop and then <laughs> I'm not saying that uh that you're wrong. I'm just saying I I don't know. It could it could be very like the very real. Oh you did you get him? Nice. Yep. Did did it count for you? Yes it did. Now Shoot. we've got to go to this person's home. Oop. Not the crawlers. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. Yeah, people always leave crawlers. I always come crawling uh, back. But Japanese toilets are either really, really nice or really weird. You know, like, like Asian, some Asian toilets are like you have to squat over like a hole in the floor. But like some are like so futuristic, it's like a robot is washing your butthole for you. Mm. And like, oh, I'd rather squat over me. a hole, really. Then have a robot wash your butthole. Um, no. Like, I'll do it myself, thanks. I'll totally let robots do horrific things to me. Yeah, but I just don't think they do a good job. That's that's the thing. It's not like, well, I don't want a robot touching my bum. It's like, no, I just don't think... I don't have faith in their ability to really get me clean. But I don't know. I'd try it once and see, like, oh, maybe like maybe it's even better than what I can do with yeah, paper. Exactly. I don't know. I don't know. 
what if they had like some form of awesome scanning device that scanned your butt for like any traces of anything that isn't butt and like uh used like a high pressure water system that like is not high enough pressure to like remove your skin but really good like nice massaging mm-hmm. water pressure to like wash away any uh any remnants that would totally yeah. be worth it yeah yeah and i mean then you'd be not using paper so like i'd be all for that but you know it's like it's gotta be clean mm. gotta do a good job so, next next place we're planning on going on a trip to is Japan, so uh, the reader can get a robot to wash her butthole. Mm-hmm. Phil, which choice did you make here? Uh, I chose whatever was first. I'm now going to talk to Ulov, whichever that was. Okay. He was a dude. Which is this guy down here. You yeah. love Stormwall. You love Stormwall. <laughs> yeah, there is probably a danger of electrocuting your gentles with letting robots like do horrific things <laughs> down there. But I mean, some people, some people pay for like genital electrocution. So I mean, so you're getting like two things for the price of one almost. Mm. Uh, what do you reckon we should do? Use the altar, which is entering that town down there, or going north to deliver the letter. North would probably be easier. Okay, let's go north. But then we we should wrap it up. Sadly, you, ooh, sadly, Tamriel Drifter, you have come to uh, our stream a little bit late because we are streaming for a few more minutes, and then mm. we're going to have a bit of a break, and then we're going to be it's streaming cities skylines uh, for a couple of hours tonight. Uh, oh, oh, oh! Oh, I made it. No oh damage god. whatsoever. Oh god, oh, that was not graceful. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> but I am if... hungry. Yeah, I'm pretty hungry myself. So. If anybody out there in internet land is looking bug for loss. someone to electrocute their genitals. Oh, yeah, let's, uh, let's find some bug loss. Here it is. I found it. <laughs> Make sure you're playing safely with electricity, though. Yep. Show mercy. Yes, this. There we go. I can't pick up this. This isn't happening. This? Oh, have you not got any space left? There, I made a space. Yay! <gasps> I just dinged. When did you ding? Uh, I dang a little bit. Dang. Uh, I'm like a quarter of the way in. A dang a quarter of a level ago. Dang! Dang! So is this area we're going to go into an actual town, or is this area a... Like, just a questy town thing? I don't know what area we're about to go into, so I don't know how to answer the question. Cragonmore, this area. Uh, it's okay. an actual Fifty time. Shades of Elder Scrolls again. Thank you very much. <laughs> if you if you uh, haven't already subscribed, uh, subscribe and then you'll catch and find us. You'll find out when we're streaming next. Uh, I'll update you. Mm-hmm. And if you if you go onto our Twitter as well, we update on Twitter when we're doing more Elder Scrolls. Mm-hmm. But as he said earlier, we'll be playing City Skylines after we have our dinner break. Yeah. In about an hour. So if you like City Skylines, feel free to watch that. Yes, this does in fact appear to be a mini town. It's I know there's following. definitely quests in here. Thank I just you. heard my phone notify me, so I know that I know that was you. Well, sh- should we get to this w- way shrine, teleport back to where we always teleport to, and then do our end plate? Mm-hmm. Little outro. Cheers me up every time. Yeah, if you haven't seen this outro, you should stay and watch until we've done this outro. It's pretty oh, it's fantastic. <laughs> How? Where the hell are the ladders to get me into this way shrine? Uh, you're supposed to be able oh, to jump. Is. This is a city for giants. <laughs> How can the people find the way shrine if they can't even jump over the wall? 
Right, here we go. Fuck here now. Whoa, what's her name? Hulte. Oh, I like it. <laughs> I like it. Kroganmore. Going back to the heavens, watch. Same I'm having myself a time. Always go. Where we got married. Yes. How many, how many let's months get back ago to the way was shrine. it now? <laughs> Two days. <laughs> oh, it's been so long. <laughs> <laughs> Feels like it's been years. Oh yeah, I'm sure that's what it is. Uh, uh, help me. Help me. <laughs> Making me sad over here. That's fine, don't feel sad. Well, thank you everyone for watching. Indeed. Bye -bye. Yeah, we'll catch you another time. Doing our thing now.